This is the Artie Pop Zeitgeist Baby Carrier. It's the most expensive baby carrier around. You'll know that I've seen it popping up on your Instagram feed. They have some very beautiful, fairly sexy photos and it does make you want to buy their baby carriers. We've all been there. <laughs> so I'm gonna help you decide today, are they worth the money? Now, it's a really neat, very attractive looking baby carrier. Um, it comes in loads of different designs and it really, it kind of follows the same function and form as most other baby carriers. You've got a nice thick supportive waistband here. Um, you've got an adjustable body panel, so it will go from newborn, although realistically this is best from about two or three months because um, it's quite wide up here. Baby might flop around. So best from a couple of months up to, they say a two year old, but again, you can't adjust it much height ways and it comes up that high. So realistically, this is up to probably about an 18 month old of an average size, I'd say. Now it crosses over at the back. So it makes it quite nice and easy to do up and it's just, just quite a sleek straightforward very attractive design now it doesn't have um, the option for outward facing it doesn't have any hood or extra um, head support here or they have got a little bit of padding here um, for younger babies so it's a nice sleek baby carrier but it doesn't do everything um, it does in theory do back carrying um, although I'll do a separate video on why I don't think it's ideal as a back carrier um, you're unlikely to feel super secure in it straight away um, but yeah all around it's a pretty nice baby carrier so is it worth the money well <laughs> let me start by answering these questions number one is it the best baby carrier on the market no number two is it the only beautiful one available no look at the didymos and the lenny lamb we have loads of other leopard print animal print and other beautiful baby carriers around number three is it comfy yeah i think it is for most people it's gonna be a really nice baby carrier probably for both mums and dads so do you have to spend 300 400 up to seven thousand pounds these ones i know to get a comfortable baby carrier absolutely not you do not need to be spending all this money and you are mainly paying for the brand that said, if you've got £400 lying around and you want to spend it on an attractive baby carrier, then it's your money, you may do with it as you please. <laughs> but rest assured, you don't need to be spending that kind of big money. We've got loads of fantastic options, starting from you know £35 all the way up to about £200, wheremybaby.co.uk. Loads and loads of beautiful baby carrier options. Now I would say, if you are committed to buying Artipop, please buy the cotton one, it's the least expensive. But if you're looking at the ones that are between £700 and £7,000, that's right. And um, they're likely going to be fabric blends. So they're going to be cotton combined with things like mulberry silk, wool and lacuna, which is the world's most expensive animal fiber. Now, it doesn't matter how much you spend on your baby carrier, your baby will almost certainly still be sick in it or poop on it at some point. And <laughs> believe me, you do not want the hassle of trying to clean up that kind of uh, situation from those kinds of fabrics. So yes, the Artipop is a very pretty baby carrier. I'm not sure I'd spend all that money on it myself. Um, if you want to know some other options, just give me a shout. <laughs>